So, you know, I love people, man. I love people. Like, if you took everything away from me and all I had was helping people, I'd still be the richest guy I know. I love that. That's true. That's real, man. And flipping around, one of the things that I love that you say is never waste a hater, their fuel. I mean, so what do you say to them, right? They talk shit about you. They talk about the lawsuits. They talk stuff about the smack about the church and all this other stuff there. Like, what do you say to them? How does this drive you forward? Thank I you. love it. Thank you. Thank you. Simple guys. as that. There's nobody that promotes me better than a hater. They're the best, best gift I have been given is the haters. Okay. Uh, I watched a guy, I watched two guys that have been kicked, kicked out of the, the, my, my, my world, uh, because of the way they acted. They did an <clears throat> interview, a one hour interview for 45 minutes. They talk shit about me. Thank you. Cannot thank you enough. I cannot buy that ad time. Nobody will let you buy 45 minutes of ad time. People just sat there and watched them fucking argue about Grant Cardone, Grant this, Grant that. He's wrong about this. He's wrong about it. But the whole time, people, that what they don't understand, man, is haters. Haters, number one, are a perverted form of admiration. Yeah. I don't want to stop it. I don't want to block it. It is admiration. It is a form of admiration and attention. And I could never pay for that. So if they're willing to invest their time and their energy and their creativity in hating on me while they're doing that, by the way, they're not creating anything. And all they're doing is leaving little nuggets about Grant. And, uh, you know, look, I, the other thing is I've never known a successful person on this planet from Jesus to Gandhi to King to Kennedy to Barack to Trump that wasn't hated. Yeah. Well, bring it on, ding dong. Let's go, man. I love it. I, lo I love it, man.